On July 3, 1988, the U.S. Navy ship called the Vansen shot down Iran Air Flight 655 heading to Dubai from Bandar Abbas, from an airport that was used by both civilian and military aircrafts. The incident took place over Iran's territorial waters in the Persian Gulf. Under the command of Captain William Rogers, the Vansons presumably mistook the Airbus A300 civilian airliner with a much smaller and faster attacking F-14 fighter jet and fired two surface-to-air missiles, killing all the 290 passengers on board, including 66 children, 46 foreigners, and 16 crew members. The United States government claimed that the collapse of the Iran Air Flight 655 was an accident and that they had made a mistake, but later evidence disapproved it. According to the Iranian government, Vansons irresponsibly and purposefully shot down the civilian aircraft. While issuing notes of regret over the loss of human life, the U.S. government has to date neither admitted any wrongdoing nor taken responsibility regarding this tragedy. In fact, the men of the Vansons were all awarded combat action ribbons. Commander Lustig, the Air Warfare Coordinator, even won the Navy's Commendation Medal for heroic achievement. The captain of the warship, William Rogers, too, was later on awarded the Navy Commendation Medal at the end of his service. In 1996, the United States and Iran reached a settlement at the International Court of Justice. As a part of the settlement, the United States did not admit legal responsibility, but agreed to pay on $61.8 million in compensation to the families of the Iranian victims. This incident created lots of criticism of the United States. Analysts blame the captain of Vansen, who had entered Iran's waters, for reckless and aggressive behavior in a stressful and dangerous environment. On November 6, 2003, the International Court of Justice concluded that the U.S. Navy's actions in the Persian Gulf at the time had been unlawful. Iran Air continues to use Flight Number 655 on the Tehran to Dubai route as a memorial to the victims.